हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम बैक टू एवरी थिंग यूजफुल आई एम शिखा तिवारी एंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट मेरिस्टमेटिक टिश्यूज इट्स टाइप्स हैव यू एवर वंडर्ड हाउ प्लांट्स ग्रो टॉलर और हाउ दे रिपेयर दम सेल्स आफ्टर बींग डैमेज सो मेरिस्टमेटिक टिश्यूज होल्ड द आंसर मेरिस्टमेटिक टिश्यूज आर स्पेशल टाइप्स ऑफ प्लांट टिश्यूज दैट आर रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर ग्रोथ इन डिवलपमेंट ऑफ प्लांट्स इफ वी टेक अ रियल लाइफ एग्जाम्पल टू अंडरस्टैंड इट प्रॉपरली इमेजिन योर बॉडी इज लाइक अ बिल्डिंग जस्ट एज अ बिल्डिंग नीड्स वर्कर्स टू एड न्यू फ्लोर्स और रूम्स सिमिलरली प्लांट्स ऑल्सो नीड अ स्पेशल टाइप ऑफ टिश्यू टू ग्रो इन डिवलप दिस टिश्यू is called meristematic tissue so meristematic tissues are found at the tips of roots and shoots in the plants they are made up of cells that divide rapidly creating new cells that can become different types of plant tissues like the ones you find in leaves stems and roots meristematic tissues are classified into uh, three main types based on their location and function first is apical meristem which you can uh, see at the top of the plant uh, apical meristem uh, it always found at the tips of roots and shoots uh, they are responsible for primary growth which involves the lengthening of roots and stems second type is intercalary meristem uh, it is found between regions of mature tissues in stems and at the base of leaves in uh, like grasses responsible for it is responsible for secondary growth which involves the increase in its width or diameter of stems and branches it it increases diameter of stems and branches intercalary meristem allows for the regeneration of damaged part of plant and contribute to its ability to tolerate grazing or cutting you can see in grasses they enable rapid regrowth after being grazed by animals so this is the main function of intercalary meristem uh, if we we'll take a real life example uh, to understand it more uh, deeply consider the regrowth of grass after being grazed by animals the portion of grass that was cut uh, starts growing back rapidly from the base where the intercalary meristem is located this allows the grass to quickly recover and continue its growth okay so uh, last third one is third type is लेट्रल मेरिस्टम लेट्रल मेरिस्टम इट इज फाउंड अलॉन्ग दी साइड्स ऑफ स्टेम्स एंड रूट्स इट इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल इट इज ऑल्सो रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर सेकेंडरी ग्रोथ विच रिजल्ट इन द थिकनिंग ऑफ स्टेम्स एंड रूट्स लेट्रल मेरिस्टम प्रोड्यूस सेकेंडरी टिश्यूज कॉल्ड जायलम एंड फॉयलम इन these tissues provide structural support and help in transporting water nutrients and sugar throughout the plant uh, if you uh, look in real life uh, you can look at the trunk of a tree or a stem of a woody plant as the plant uh, growing after years and years its stems or trunk becomes thicker and stronger this increase in thickness is due to the Uh, lateral meristems which produce secondary tissues like wood and bark these tissues provide support and protection to the plant so this is all about the meristematic tissues